is there something styles make fights right now max max holloway has just been such a beast pretty much everywhere um specifically on the feet now you being the stand-up coach do you i mean nobody's indestructible are you seeing any holes up there that you could capitalize yeah there's a couple of holes that i see you know me and brian were you know we've been working on this for a while now so i think we'll be ready for him that... we'll definitely be ready for max because i remember with um with Frankie Edgar, that uppercut, I remember you guys would tell me you had to be, like, specifically for right. Frankie, you were getting ready for that rush, and it was something you specifically, like, it's not, it didn't just come out of nowhere, like, you guys were planning that. So I'm like, man, let me see, what what do they have for Max? I know you don't want to show your your, you your hand, but I'm just like, man, where is the... The, uh, the Chinese the... secret. Yes! <laughs> Can you talk about uh, Derek Lewis and his style? How did you see this fight going? Mm. Okay, Derek Lewis and his style. So, can you remind me his style first? Because I... <laughs> <laughs> what is his style? He's a big guy that comes forward. I guess is is if, if, if that's his style. Okay, I'm another big guy, but um, you know. Instead to go forward, we will be smarter and go back to to, to the Francis before the the last fight. You know, watch my opponent, leave it come to me, and then uh, as soon as he gives me he gave, gives me the opportunity, I take it. Um, this fight. Is one of the biggest fights I'm looking forward to, though, because just because just for the just for what you said, I, I know there's genuine animosity between you two, and, and it's going to be so interesting and it's going to be fun. And uh, I know he was. I just don't want him to try to hug me and shake hands after the fight. Really, you 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 don't, you don't want that. No, I just don't want him to try to be. Oh man, I and mean, then I just did this to build up the fight, and then I don't want that. Just just take the L, retire, get do us all the favor. <laughs> Nobody really wants to hear him talk crap again. If after he gets beat down like a damn dog by me, nobody's gonna want to hear him talk shit again. The only reason people are listening now because Connor's out, John's out, Ronda's gone. Who is the star right now? They're dying for a star. There's not a superstar out right now. So therefore, fans are willing to know that you're jumping off the rope, falling through the table. And they're willing to accept it because there's nothing else going on right now. So he had perfect timing on when he started his antics. You know what I mean? It got him where he needed to go. He did get into the head. I said this all along. RDA is a better martial artist mm -hmm. than Kobe. But if Kobe gets into his head, there's a chance Kobe can beat him surely off that. RDA never got a chance to fight Connor. So we, as fans, we never got a chance to see how he would react emotionally to someone talking to him. Me, on the other hand, I've been prepared to fight Nick Diaz or Bisping or Conor McGregor, guys that I know that are going to do that. And also been prepared to keep my poise and just go out there and do my thing. Have you ever had anyone that you hated more that, you're gonna, that you ever fought? I've never fought anybody I didn't like. Wow. Ever. Everybody i fought so far, I respected and I liked. Who is, the, who is your GOAT? You know what? <laughs> Not his real gun. He doesn't yeah, yeah. go behind well, us. Well, that, that's betty, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's so hard to say as far as, you know, who's the greatest fighter that's ever lived in every weight class or anything like that. Mm -hmm. You know, I'm going to tell you, the best fighter I have ever seen. Sure. All right? And this is just fighting. Mm -hmm. Is John Jones. Yeah. John Jones has the fight IQ. He has the body type, the skill, the ability in what he does. I've never seen a fighter that is as capable as John Jones in an MMA. You can look at Demetrius Johnson is great. Fedor had an unbelievable string. Anderson Silva was a great fighter for a while. Mm -hmm. John Jones, you know, look at he's undefeated. Yeah. And he has faced the very best that you can put against him. And he uh, his one loss and he hasn't is, always been in the best of shape. shape. <laughs> he's got some and, stuff he's been doing and, outside. And that's part of, part of what he does on the outside. You look and you go, I hate to say that just shows you how actually 
you know, gifted he is. But he does train hard when he trains. It's just sometimes he can't get up for that person to train. But yeah. if I was going to say who is the best fighter I've ever seen, pound for pound, it would be John Jones.